welcome to sketchware tutorials and in this video i'm going to show you how to use random number concept yes most of the android games and web games also uh, using artificial intelligence they use the random number concepts for example dice and our comparison or a blackjack or something any any games with comparison they use the component called random number and today i'll show you how to do that uh, to do that, sorry, uh, start with a new project and name it as your wish. And here to demonstrate you, I am taking a text view, simple text view and a simple button. That's it. And uh, uh, what I want to say, what if I say I am taking a linear layout and I'm taking this text view inside it and now I'm going to modify the properties 30 SP and it's going to be bold text view changes to demo of sorry demo of random number that's it and button is changed to 20 sp and text of the button changes to random it that's it and <clears throat> as you can see now on logic section using the random number component you have to create a new variable to create a new variable simply go to the variable section and add a variable the variable type is going to be number because the random number itself a number so i'm going to name it as num itself and i'm going to initialize it with one that's it and when button one is clicked as you can see um, I'll pick a random it and here when button 1 is clicked as you can see I have to set this number variable to operator and here as you can see pick random number 2 1 2 5 and I am taking an if block and an operator to compare it logical operator and if the number variable is equal to ooh, no 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 I made it as like this and now I am going to the view section and go to the set text and set text color that's it and i simply copy this and paste it for other sections because um here i am making a lower bone as one and upper bone as five that means it generates the random numbers between one and five and uh, including one and five also for example if i uh, want to say if i pre if i make a lower bone to two and upper bone to three then it generates a random numbers 2 and 3 ok ok that's it only 2 numbers and now I am going to copy this this is third one and this is fourth one and this is fifth one and if number variable is equal to 1 and I am going to set the text view 1 to 1 itself and I'm going to set the text view color to red and if number variable is equal to 2 then I'm going to set the text view 1 to 2 and I'll set the color of the text to pink and if number variable is equal to 3 I'm going to text view as 
minus 3 and set text color to purple that's it if number variable is equal to 4 then simply set text use color to 4 and set text color to the purple and repeat it for other sections also you can set whatever you want for example uh, if you want to if you are making a flipping a toss coin you will generate two numbers one and two and for heads you have to assign uh, one and for tails you have to assign two and you have to generate pick random number one to two and if the random number is one you have to set uh, the where is it image set image to head image you have to import two images head image and tail image and uh, you have to set head image when he, when it uh, picks the random number one and uh, when it picks the random number two you have to set image to two this is only just a possibility i am demonstrating here you can make anything you want i am just uh, showing you how to do that that's it and let's try to run the app and that is installing yes let's open the app as you can see the default color of the text view is black and if I press the random it button it changes to one and if I press random it changes to and see friends it first changes to 2 and then changes to 3 and now it changes to 1 not 4 and 5 it does not go sequentially it can generate randomly it is not unique and as you can see now here different random numbers are uh, present that's it and here um, I'm going to show you a bonus strip here so to do that bonus I am going to take another text view and I am going to rename it as welcome to sketchware tutorials for example in the introduction page you have to wish the user that's very important guys so that's why I'm taking this and I'm going to modify it to make it center Where is it sorry 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 and background color sorry that's it now it becomes center and if I simply oh sorry and if I simply um, copy this entire logic and I'm going to add another event activity on start that is on activity becoming visible and I can simply paste it here and before pasting it here I have to add a component called timer for timing actions as I previously told timer is used for timing actions and if I press it here then timer task after 0 milliseconds for every what I mean to say um, 200 milliseconds is sufficient I think so and I am going to remove it now because it changes the text that's why I, I, I am removing only the text view and I will change this text view 1 to text view 2 because our welcome message is in text view 2 and I will change it to text view 2 text view 2 that's it and 
let's update the app and as you can see now the app is running and the app is installing and when you open the app as you can see now welcome to sketch for tutorials is flashing with different colors and it's very looking very good and random it concept is also also working and it's also working that's it for today guys we can do wonders with random number more updates coming soon and please like and subscribe for more videos goodbye